Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Thursday, July 14th, 2022. The tarot card for today is The Hanged Man, and this is another one coming to us from Tarot Disassembled by artist Jennifer Cooper Stiley, and you can follow her on Instagram at the handle at Ferocious Inc. Now, I know what I want to say, and I know what I want it to be, but I think we need to discuss different aspects of this card anyway because you know he is the fool on his journey who kind of gets caught up in the you know snag right sometimes we hit a speed bump sometimes we need a whole different perspective on how to do things <sighs> you know and we need to look at them from different angles and sometimes we need to let some things go we need to make a sacrifice but what I want to say, all right, and I don't feel like it plays out immediately, like overnight, but yesterday we had the full moon, and, I, you know, the words in my head are, flip the script, all right, what in your life has needed flipped upside down, so it's not so much about you being stalled or having delays or, or having to make sacrifices, even though you might but flipping the script and i think we need to see what other cards are coming up in the future to assist with this because once you get that you know script the way your life is going flipped in another direction where it's taking on a new trajectory uh, these next couple of weeks there's a lot that's happening especially between this full moon and the next full moon bear with me the moon today starts off still in Capricorn where we had our full moon two days ago yesterday and yesterday how I lose track already and it will be moving into Aquarius early in the morning but before it moves into Aquarius um you know we've got a major aspect that's happening early in the morning which could have been felt yesterday today part of that influence in the full moon itself Venus square Neptune boy you know it, it, there, there's a lack of perception there okay quite honestly when it comes to love money um, you know even how you feel about your own self when it comes to self-care things of that nature so I, you know I can kind of see it relating a little bit to this card in and of its own but it, you know, it is what it is. When things become a little clouded, you know, with Neptune, it's best to just stand back and remind yourself that it's energy. Now, we have a few aspects today which are happening. They may not all apply to you. The, the one that concerns me the most is the, the Aquarius moon squaring Mars. Yeah, things just get a little, you know, don't poke the bear, don't be triggered, don't be on either end of it, you know, that kind of thing. So, you know, that could put you in a position where with this card, you know, feeling like you've been hung out to dry, you know, when people start, don't let anyone be the aggressor. And the best way to do that is to just walk away and not engage. So there's a good chance that you have been working on and putting things into a new perspective in order to flip the script, right? Because it's the perfect timing in the course of this month and how I see it, all right? And it's leading you somewhere. If you listen to like the love and finance and the full moon reading and the sun sign readings, you might have a clue as to what I'm referring to. So, with that being said, I want to thank you all very much for being here. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.